What's going on fellow nerds, B Mina here, here with my wife as a guest in our channel for the very first time, doing the very first time a Harry Potter minifigure mystery uh, pack. And my wife, E Mina, is right beside me and she will be opening these Harry Potter mystery minifigures on our channel today. So sit back, relax, and get ready for something brand new to the channel. As you can see behind you, we have... Some Harry Potter uh, Lego sets. The one in the middle is from the first release, way back in, I believe, the... 2010. 2000s, yeah. Like, probably towards the end of the 2000s, and then 2010. And then the ones on the side are from newly released, ones from Target and Walmart and, Walmart and, and everywhere. Noble. Yeah, Thanks, it's the more recent, recent releases. So uh, right here we do have displayed this particular set, the ones on the edges, which is the Aragorg Lair set. It has 157 pieces. Um, you pretty much have the Aragorg right there, which has leg and teeth articulation and also the uh, lower back as well. And then we have Harry Potter and Ron Weasley right here um, that are also displayed, as you can see. And right you can there. tell they're from the newer set because they have the shorter legs. That is correct, guys. Shorter legs, no articulation there. You can't really bend it or swivel it. It's just the short legs for the newer sets. It's kind of hard to tell, but from the older set from 2010 and um, earlier, um, Harry Potter does have longer legs, but we'll get into more details on that a little later in later videos. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't done or so already to this channel. If you're new, welcome, and we'll get right into it. Here we go, first pack, guys. I think it's Voldemort. <laughs> it is. And our first mini fig for the video is none other than the Dark Lord himself. The Dark Lord himself. There he goes. And of course he has Nagini with him. Alright, don't you want to go ahead and uh, show it a little bit closer to the Gotta get his wand, baby. Sorry. So, Dark Lord so is, is nothing without his wand, even though it's not the. It's not the. There you go. Can I bring it a little closer. There you go. So to give you guys a little bit of more detail, up close detail of the Voldemort mini figure, that is exactly how it looks. Here's the front, the side, and back. Comes with. Just like my wife said, Nagini, the, Not the a lot of detail. Yeah, the Horcrux, the last Horcrux. Well, sec yeah, the second to the last Horcrux because Harry Potter is obviously the last Horcrux. Well, in the movie, Nagini is the last Horcrux oh. guy, though. So. All right, so there you have it, guys. <laughs> Harry Potter enthusiasts, right here, and we'll kind of give you a little bit of a preview, or just we're going to show you the checklist here. So those are the, how many are there in total? 16 figures from this series. It also includes not only just uh, Harry Potter characters, but it also includes Fantastic Beast as well. So there you go. There's the back side oh, yeah. of that. So there is more. These are the Fantastic Beasts. And then Fantastic Beast characters right there is Salaman Salamander. Newt. Or Newt Salamander, you know. Salamander. Salamander. That's yeah, you know, you know, you can totally tell I am like totally, I totally know you everything about Harry Potter and Do Fantastic not. No. So, oh my gosh. Going on to the second pack. Forgive him. It's okay. <laughs> and then our second pack is... From the Fantastic Bees. Nice. It's um, the sister, oh my goodness. I don't even know her name too. Um, it's a 
sister? Yeah, so it's not the... I thought it was Newt for some reason. No. It's, not. it's the girl with hair. Yeah, What's her name? Face. She... Does it say on here? Falls for the muggle. Okay. Of course, who's the baker? Gold, Goldie, I want to say her name is? Oh, darn it. Let's see? Not a fantastic beast. <laughs> not... Not haven't quite gotten too into depth with the Fantastic Beast really series, hold it very well. um, but you ask my wife anything <laughs> about Harry Potter, like any trivia question, she'll pretty much know it from the back of her head. They all come with like a two pack wand where you can like break it off. All right, what is, what is this? A, a baguette? Yeah, that's like the bun because she falls in love with the well, the, it's hinted the that bun. Going, but she can't really hold the bun very well. Yeah, go in. It's all right. We'll figure it out. Go ahead and feel free to leave a comment in the comment section if you know this character's name from the Fantastic Beast series. So there's that up close. We'll set that right back there next to Voldemort. Queenie Goldstein. Right. Well, there you go, Queenie. All right. G Gold. And so, moving on to the final pack for this opening. Fantastic Beasts for Harry Potter. Let's see. Okay, there's that. Looks like it is... Mad Eye Moody! Oh, Mad why'd they give him like Moody. a side that doesn't have his Mad Eye and then a side that Maybe does? Maybe it was before he got the Mad Eye. Oh, you know what it is? Mm. Is I think you can make him into Barty Crouch Jr. And that's why on this side, it has the tongue sticking out because Barty Crouch Jr. used the Polyjuice poach Potion to be Mad-Eye Moody. There you go. And that is also why it has two hair sets. Oh, look at that. Oh, man. See what I tell you guys, she knows, she knows her stuff. <laughs> she knows her stuff when it comes to Harry Potter. See, and so, this is for his Polyjuice Potion. Polyjuice Potion right there. And he has his little, what is that? Walking. His walking stick. Stick. Oops. Oh, no, his <laughs> hair flew off. <laughs> Be caution. Projectiles will fly at you during assembly. There you go. And... So this is him as Mad-Eye. Can you see, kind of? Yeah. There you go. Mad Eye with his walking stick and his wand. And then if you switch it and turn his head around, and it's Barty Crouch Jr. trying to impersonate Mad Eye. And then you probably want to give him the polyjuice potion. <laughs> a little off uh, okay, oh, focus. On. There you go. That is the imposter with its tongue sticking out. Oh. So there you have it. Um, let's do a little comparison with the short legs and the long legs. As you can see, guys, um, let's get a little closer right there. It's, it's a big difference. Yeah. You can move, you can swivel the legs front and back with the longer legs and then the shorter legs you cannot. So this one didn't come from a mystery pack, but they started to do the short legs on the second round, the new ones that are coming out because people were complaining like, these are the adults, they should have the full length legs, and then these ones are kids, so they should have the shorter legs. So that's why they're trying to be a little bit more accurate. And precise, and to, precise. to the characters yeah. in the movie. So there's that, and here is also a close-up on Ron Weasley. Look, with his lantern and his wand, he looks all frantic and scared, so. Yeah. And there you have it. You can even see it on these ones too, where if you look, they have the short legs mm -hmm. for them, but like for for these ones, like Tina and Newt, they have the full length legs. There we go. Full length legs. There you have it, guys. Fantastic Beast. Harry Potter. Just want to give a big thank you to my wife, E. Nina, for coming and doing a guest host for um, the Harry Potter Lego set. Uh, feel free to leave a like and uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Again, 
Thank you guys for watching. This is B Mina and E Mina signing out for Nerdy Nation Collectibles, guys. Have a good one.